everyone and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Urban Rivals, yay! And that will have come out really crap, because Meep0112 could just introduce one of his videos with a bunch of swear words and it'd still sound awesome. But that was in my, uh, my little homage to him. Anyway, today it is a recorded match against Zack016, or Zack16. Um, we're playing T1. He said uh, T1 or ELO, but um, I can never remember who's banned, so <laughs> we decided to go with T1, and today we're going with a deck, a half and half, which I like to call Science Funding. Now, it's almost two. I said I'd be in the guild room, so I wonder if he's there. And sure enough, he, oh, you better not have stood me up. <laughs> You'd better not have stood me up, mate. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, uh, I, I'm just, <laughs> I had no idea what to say then. I was going to say, actually, um... Zach actually got in touch with me um, on Monday, saying he wanted a match, and I said, sure, we'll arrange something. And, it, you know, I'd originally had the intention that it was going to be recorded. So I was like, you know, give her the time, give her the date, and we were originally going to um, do it, you know, yesterday. But I have so much to do on assignments. We've had a 500 text review, well, a 500 word text review um, thrown onto us. And it was like, can we do it today on Sunday? Because I wanted to catch up on assignments and stuff. And it was like, okay, yeah, Sunday's alright. Maybe. Maybe he's in the middle of a match or something and it might have taken him a while to, uh, you know, get out of whatever he was doing because before I recorded this video it said he was online. And I'm just gabbling on about, you know, randomly now because I have no idea what to say. I can't, I can't say anything until the cards come up. Oh wait, did I? I didn't even say what my half-half was, was it? Did I? <laughs> but, uh... You know, I figured it might be obvious from the name, Science Funding. It's um, Upper's Geist. The um, original title was going to be Science Can Be Sexy because of uh, the two guys that I revolved the deck around. Um, you, you'd look at them both and be like, no, that, no, no, just no, Miho, no. But um, no, uh, Jonas is sexy, and I think Jax has this weird kind of allurance to him in his first form, which kind of pees me off that I have to play with him in uh, last form, because he looks like a, he looks like I'd still hug him, but he looks like a bit of a Hulk. Or as um, as Graf once uh, said to me, he looks big and brainless. <laughs> Now I wasn't I wasn't trying to do accent then, but <laughs> oh, what to say? What to say? You know, one day I'm actually going to use the webcam to um, show you guys the artwork on the wall because sometimes it's nice to look at it, but sometimes it's just so weird just have them all staring at you and <laughs> oh, who have we got I'm sure I must have said it before in a previous video like who I've got on the wall but we have quite a few uppers there's Jonas Jeeves, Sydney and my original character Katarina in a kind of poster parody of Arthur. That's the Russell Brand remake they did. Um, was it last? No, it was. It was last year they did it, wasn't it? Yeah, last year when they released re released Arthur. Then I got. Oh god, <laughs> you you don't want you, you don't want to hear me babbling on about blooming artwork on my wall. And I'm not happy now. We made an arrangement, and I'm not happy. <laughs> oh, I don't want to go looking for him. In case I miss him. Mm. 
you'll only see part of this new tab but uh, just see if you sent a message, no he's not even sent a message to me or anything because I sent a message to him 25 minutes ago saying uh, I'll see you in the yeah it says he's online, where are you? oh, oh no wait what if, what if he can, what if he's in the guild room and he can't see me? Oh, no that's never, that's never happened, that's never happened and before you're all like, oh, they will pro probably end up... There he is. Hooray. I was going to say it, you know, in case anyone was thinking, oh, what if he's not even in the same guild? Uh, he is in the guild. He's the one who even said we'll do it in the guild room. Oh, I could have phrased that a bit better, couldn't I? <laughs> oh, yeah. Quick, but... Uh, I, gu I guess he only wants one fight, guys. Oh, let's see. He better have kept a T1. Because I made my deck based around that. And I, s I spent ages because I usually just throw a load of powerhouses in there and play T2. And, oh, mm, Montana Jonks. This is a promising deck. Oh, Jonas, why did you not show up? At least we got Jax. That's cool. Uh, um, you've got you got anyone who got someone who stops bonus but you haven't got anyone who stops the ability so I could put Ast Astrid would be such a predictable move right now though wait a minute if we take you haven't got any damage users no no you haven't um and so I don't know I don't know I want to save Mori Maurice for uh, Sharon Oh, Jeebus. Um, just stick, um, throw jacks out there, guys. Uh, yeah, we'll keep it at that. Just throw jacks out there and see what happens. At least if we win this, we'll um, continue disciplined, the uh, whatever the mission's called for Geist and uh, Jet Set for uppers. I will say something right now. He, there is no point in the comic where his eyes have turned red. There's, there's a funny point in the battle where he looks completely stoned out of his head, but he's not, you know, his eyes do not turn red at all. So that's like, you know. And I just want to, I just want to say something about Scott. At no point in the comic yet does he take any of his other Oh wait, he takes his second form. Wait, is he? Okay, I don't look. I don't make a point of looking at Scott a lot because I think he's a prick. But, and you guys know that already. But, um, I keep. It's either it's it's either second or third form where he's got his blue coat. He is shown with that blue coat on, but he's not shown with just like the ripped shirt and the. You know the where he looks like he's gonna punch someone, and he's definitely not in, in his final form anywhere in the comic. I could still win this, but Th this is really, <sighs> you know, I wish I hadn't said it looks a promising deck now because it's turning out to be. Um, blah 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 blah. blah, blah. You take. Why do I have the weirdest feeling that? You are going to play Trimo with one pill. You s can't make you can't make the KO, but okay. We'll stick two on Palak. Oh yeah. So in case he does one pill with evil one of them then we'll be on equal footing. You're probably expecting me to say, oh this deck was doing so well before the video. It was actually 
doing quite average because I'm not used I mean whenever I play Geist I never put Astrid in my deck I should do but I don't and I originally had Lubra in there and I thought actually you know it'd be good to have um, a life taker in there instead of someone who relies on the opponent for damage holy faux chisel You can't take the fuel. Oh. Darn it, deck. Oh well. Wait, do I? Oh, darn it. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So you've got three, but I'll have the pill. Can I risk fury? Hang on. I have. Oh no, oh no, I don't know. You get the eight, but I take two attack from you because. Oh. Bow oh, shizzle. I don't want to risk fury and then oh dog oh. I hate it when I get in a situation like this because I'm going to lose anyway but I want to lose with a minimal life gap but this game is about risks let's take them Oh yeah, you've gone for the winning in pills to get more points approach. See, we've only lost um, five to three now, instead of just five to. No, wait, seven to three. And that was pretty good. And I take the fact he said quick battle means he doesn't have the uh, time for another match. We'll just have to see if he says anything or whether he challenges us again oh no I guess it was just one fight but um you know I, f I feel like this video is I know some people often have just one fight and the video lasts five minutes but I would just like to uh, you know make because I'm you know I'm gonna try and hold back on the videos well hold off from the videos for the next couple of weeks so I can finish off these assignments and such. Um, I definitely want to make a video next, not this w upcoming week, but next week. Um, because I have Manga Night a week tomorrow and I'll be doing my Jack's cosplay so I definitely want to do a video showing you that. But as I said, since I'll be holding off on videos, I'll, you know, let's throw in a bonus e ELO fight. And I never said that was a good battle. So if you're watching this, you know, thank you. Junks Montana is always a intriguing combination. And when we're against Fang Pie, and I'm worried. I was at there he is. <laughs> I was hoping to do a Fang Pie deck and call it, you know, have a taste of this Fang Pie. But have you ever noticed that all the Fang Pies have got quite high star counts? Have you ever noticed that? And it's like, have I even got Chan? I don't even think I've got Chan. <laughs> but I've got you, and I've got you, and I've got you. <laughs> Na, you, zu. <laughs> Na, you, zu. That should be the name of the new character of new character, Nayuzu. Or as I said in my first video that I ever did with the vortex. Bang your head into the keyboard. <laughs> uh, I actually came up with a new vortex character yesterday. Um, who has Berserk ancestry. Her name's Shirai with its S H O R A I I. And uh, her name's taken from Shorai Teki, which is the Japanese word for futures. And she's a girl, so no guessing who her. Uh, well, no guessing. No prizes for guessing her ancestor. And, as, and I was going to say, probably one of the uh, first names. Well, one of the few names that. Um, 
you know, doesn't involve randomness. It actually has meaning to it. And I'm, I'm babbling on about stuff again, and I don't know. You've, you've got three, five, seven. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to use one of the defeats because it's still quite high. Ooh! I was, I was thinking about abilities earlier on and I want to pose a question to you guys because I'm absolute rank at stats. Um, if, you know, I, I was just curious, I'm not trying to do anything. I was just thinking, if there was a two star, say there was a, a two star with Loretta's 7-1 stats, could be any clan and their ability was stop damage plus whatever i was thinking what would what would be like the maximum number on the stop damage plus before the card was considered overpowered cuz i'm thinking if it was a card like in the junter or the fang pie then it would have to be lower surely but say say you have a 712 star in like the uppers for example and their ability was stop damage plus four which would bring it to seven five would stop damage plus five be too overpowered or would you have to stop at damage plus four because i'm just i'm just curious as to what the highest number could be before people would start saying oh it's overpowered And just and just thinking about uppers, I think they should have a support plus life card. I, I think it would, I think it would work. Because I understand, I understand that the berserk don't have any damage reducers because they're supposed to be like these, you know, the with the scar thing. It's made, you know, scarlet skin. It's made them all tough, and uh, you know, they will take as much damage as they need to. So they use defeat plus life to act as a damage reducer of sorts. But I think any I think any ability could work with any clan as you know, and you could still work it within the clan's basis. I mean, who's to say that the Geist couldn't have a plus life card? You know. You you know, you could you could have a doctor who's been forced into the Geist and doesn't want to be there but he can't escape. So he he does like a protest by, you know, helping people instead of hurting them and then his ability could be plus life. Or you could have someone in the Berserk who um you know, you know how they're all like angry because of the gas. Well with one of them it could have um I don't know it may not have reacted the same way or because they were such a timid person in real life that they've stayed that way and they you know they don't want to be hurt so they could be a damage reducer i'm just you know i'm just saying any uh, any ability could work with any clan if you use the right backstory because I actually, one of the criti- I was actually on the, um, quite a while ago, I was on the public uh, topic for, you know, if you were to make a card on this game, what would it be? And, um, someone actually critiqued me on, oh, the whole life, the whole plus life ability doesn't go well with the whole geist theme. I was thinking, screw you. You're not, you're not God. You're not that sacron guy that they all worship, you know, Glyburn Sark or whatever his name is. You're not him. 
course that's just what I was thinking I didn't say that to them because um, well I'm a chicken <laughs> no but I think people need to lay off on that topic well, unless they've made like an obviously powerful card and I've lost haven't I I'm going on about abilities and fictional cards and stuff and that guy just completely beat me. <laughs> I don't know what else I could have done though. So have you have you noticed that? How long ago was it that Bonnie um Bonnie L D had her re release? How long has it been since they took her away again? And it's still got the mission open for the pills. <laughs> Oh, and I'm doing some progress on strategic disruption, but anyway, as I said, I you know I'm trying to hold off on the video, so the earliest video that will come next is um, a week tomorrow. Um, you know, <laughs> I don't, I don't even know how to close off. Um, I was going to say whatever happens, you know, during the next week with. You are and stuff. I hope. Uh, well, what am I doing going up and down? I hope you, you know, do well, earn your points, get your real low scores up as much as you can do. You know, and this, you know, this coming Friday, we, uh, it's time for a new LD. So you know, when you start those missions, good luck. I'll be trying to get whoever it is that comes out. I'm predicting Roots or Uluwatu. And uh, anyway. You know, see you next time, whenever that will be, and keep on rivaling. Bye bye. <laughs>